Pull that foot. Hey, nice to meet you, Belinda. That's right. Uh, she's amazing. She's, um, you know, I mean, I, I, was, I was saying to a like one of the other press people here, she's someone that, she's so exuberant and, uh, and, and fun to be around. She really brings the best out of people. But I think she's brave enough to, to follow her instincts to try and, uh, to try and get a, uh, a musical, to try and f fulfill her musical vision. And um, I was lucky enough to be part of it, really. Now, how did that come about? Uh, she, I'd met Adele a couple of times. She, I'd worked with some of her friends and colleagues, and, and you know, she, like, she came, came, she came down to my studio to do some vocals on a, on a, on a record for a guy named Jack Pinato, who's an English singer-songwriter who's kind of part of the similar scene to Adele. And um, we, uh, we, we, we struck a chord. And when I finished Jack's record, and Adele was looking to do her new LP. I, uh, I pestered her manager until, uh, until he got sick of my calls to, uh, to let me have a go. And eventually we got in the room together and we wrote Rolling in the Deep. Wow. So, we well, actually wrote Rolling in the Deep and he won't go in the same day. <laughs> oh, <wow. laughs> yeah. yeah, so. Uh, now, how did that song come about? Did you come up with the concept? Did she come up with it? Yeah, or yeah, just? It was all her. All her you know? and, uh, and she had the verses all as one sort of mantra. And, um, and it just, and I kind of. It was like it was like a kind of old field holly, you know, and, it's, and we, we we took we took that and we broke it up and tried to pepper it with court, you know, with the the, tra the chorus and the transitions that would make it into something that radio would accept. But for me, I loved the kind of uh, the almost kind of spiritual feel to it that we kind of we managed to create. It was like uh, it was actually uh, it was really something really close to my heart, you know, an amazing piece of music. Wow. And what are you looking forward to for the Grammy tomorrow? Uh, I'm looking forward to seeing the Beach Boys and the Boss. <laughs> I think I like, uh, you know, it's, uh, it's def definitely more showbiz, uh, showbiz bang for your buck here than the, than the UK. <laughs> and lastly, what do you got working? What are you working on now? I try not to talk about work I'm doing until it's signed, sealed, and delivered. So um, I've been very busy and working with lots of lots of uh, lots of amazing artists. But um, I, until we'll some, let's, let's uh, get it in the bag first. Yeah, that's that's a good way to, to think about it. Well, nice meeting you. Good luck tomorrow.